a really old tape measure you may want to add to your toolbox. A fast cap, old standby flat back. Hola woodworkers, Paul Carlson here, small workshop guy. My favorite tape measure is the fast cap lefty righty carpenter tape measure. It's uh, nice and stiff, you can read it from the left side to the right side. It's got the, it's made out of metal, it's curved, uh, it, it'll hold itself well when you're stretching it out uh, without bending over. And so that, you know, we all tend to grab that one and put it on our tool belt uh, at the beginning of our play day. I call it a play day because I don't work, I just play at this stuff. But I, I got another fast cap that I'd recommend to you. Uh, when I'm using this lefty righty, because it's curved or convex, I have to tip it over in order to get that mark down there so I know I'm marking precisely. I'm kind of a precise marking nut, you know, with a 0.5 millimeter pencil, lead, uh, my incras with a little bitty uh, slots in them. I, I like it to be precise. So I don't like bending that over. Uh, not that I don't use this for all sorts of things, I do. Uh, but I keep both of them right up here, and so I decide what is it I'm going to do to pick out which one. Now, what's the other one that I might, that I might pick out? That's the um, called old standby flat back. The beauty of that is it, l it lays down right on your workpiece, and you can mark on either side, and you don't have to bend it one way or the other to get the mark down to the wood. It is flat on the wood. And I really like that. So if I'm going to do this kind of measuring, I grab this uh, measuring tape. If I'm going to do something where I need it to stay nice and stiff because I'm going to extend it, then I grab the lefty-righty. So I would add both to your uh, repertoire. Uh, if you don't know, the beauty of these is that they have uh, different ways of holding the tape uh, out with squeeze buttons, both top and bottom, and they have built-in pencil sharpeners. I hope you find that helpful. They're only about 10 bucks, so you can afford to have one of each, and I hope you find that using the right one at the right time is a pleasure. Small Workshop Guy, signing off.